Hi guys, welcome back. Mage with me, Sid, and uh, I've just been fishing. <laughs> um, I finished the tunnel. Let me show I've actually done a lot, which is why I'm recording this extra episode, because um, I feel like I'm jumping ahead too much. I'm having so much fun on here. Uh, currently we've got Papa Joe on, who is uh, he's not, not doing too well at the moment. Five deaths on the board, and Never Threal is on as well. Um, but yeah, I'm put my smeltery in down here so we've got the tunnel brings us all the way down and if I'm quick about it so night was just falling when I uh, left the fishing off over here we've got my exit now this is temporary it's going to become uh, things now there was something I wanted to check actually I can't remember whether I've got the big button or not in this big uh, no, I don't think I have. That's a shame. That was a, a rather nice little way of making um, drawbridge doors. But I never know that. If you haven't got it, you can't use it. Anyway, um, let me show you. I've been excavating and building like an idiot. So we've got three floors on now. Uh, a fourth, well... Let me show you. So everything, I've got my carpet in here, uh, I've still got my chests over there and stuff, but going down, this is uh, going to be the basement. This is work in progress. Uh, this is all a safe area, so we're not too too worried there's coal and stuff down here to get when we get around to digging it. Um, but I had to clear out the water from here and I've got to replace these walls with something nice. Now I can cycle them with the chisel in situ, but I'll probably just break them out and replace them. Um, so this is probably, if I can fit it in, going to be where I put my blood altar. That's the plan. Uh, back up the stairs and eventually I'll get some elevators in and stuff. So upstairs we go up a floor. If you can hear the dog barking like an idiot outside, that's because it's bonfire night or near about it. Um, so yeah, I've got my big room up here. I've upgraded to gold blocks on this because I think I've got my three spells here. I've created three spells. My new dig spell, which is... Um, let me show you... Uh, a touch with mining power. Touch with mining power and feather touch. And projectile mining power in combination with dig. Now, the lapis block didn't have enough modifiers to do that one. I've got first aid, which is basically self and projectile version, and it's heal and regeneration on the effect. That needs me to do some stuff. And I put together my torch spell, but one of the requirements for that is glowstone. And that is going to be a pig to get hold of. So we may have to hold off on that one a little bit. Um, or I may go today. Anyway, I've harvested some um, obsidian for that. So this is going to be my main spell crafting room. And then we go up a floor again. This is just a, obviously quite a big floor to go up. But this isn't finished. But we've got the first... The third floor coming out here and you can see we've got little me little snaky heads i've put those on the outside because i quite like them still stuck with these stinking things at the moment of course because there's no glowstone and the stairs just stop at this point right so what do we need to do well the first thing i need to do to to get this dig spell done which is my priority um Blank rune we can do, vintium dust we can do, feathers we can do, raw fish we can do, clay we can do, I can do a diamond pickaxe, I can do chimerite, I can do everything there except for earth essence and air essence. Now, the reason I can't do those is because I haven't got an essence refiner. If I have a look at, uh, let's have a look, items, essences, air essence is fairly straightforward. I've got some, I've got been out collecting stuff, so I've got Tama root, I've got feathers, so we can do air essence. Earth essence is pretty straightforward as well, um, but to make that, I need to make an essence refiner. Uh, let me just bring that up. Am I misspelling this or something, or 
There it is, S sense. Alright. Um so that's pretty straightforward. Ward obsidian, arcane ash, arcane ash we get with arcane compound, arcane compound we need netherrack and glowstone for. Here we have our problem. We have to go to the nether. And in this mod pack, the nether is going to be hell, quite frankly. Now I could get, I think, my first aid spell going. Um because that only requires some Essence from a Hoofa Doofa, Golden Apple and stuff like that. So let's get, let me get what I need together and I will be right back with you. Bloody typical, the one thing I was missing, well the two things I was missing were green dye and an apple. So uh, one thing that's nice with Britannia is you can use the Britannia dyes to, by the way the dog's still going absolutely balmy outside for uh, fireworks. Um, you can use the dies for let me just get the old pestle and mortar um, get rid of some of the stuff that we don't need like all of that so lesser focus that's pretty straight oh. the lesser focus is pretty straightforward it's just got uh, nuggets around a hoofa doofa um, piece of glass that's the word I'm looking for so it was a blank rune, it was two orms, it was a snowball and an arrow, I believe. Oh no, two vintium dust. Oh, I'll sort that in a minute. Um, so the other thing we need, we needed golden apple. I didn't have an apple. I had the gold, no apple. And we needed green dye. So going, I went out and found myself a mystical green plant. Uh, get some green dye off of that and where's my runes there we go so we get the green rune so that should be let's get the book back in place uh, okay so we need a blank rune two worms two vintium dust one lesser focus blank rune two vintium dust one lesser focus then we're going to need 500 essence, arrow, snowball, green rune. Arrow, snowball, green rune, blue rune, golden apple, I believe it is. Spell parchment. Last piece of the uh, puzzle. Uh, but not quite the last piece of the puzzle, of course, because at the moment I don't have any means of making uh, essence. That's the word I'm looking for. We'll get there eventually. Uh, I may struggle a bit on the way, but I will get there eventually. So, to make an essence, we are going to need to refer back to our arcane... Make essence, I should say, our arcane compendium. And in blocks, we should have the obelisk. Now, the obelisk is a pretty straightforward thing. Vintium dust, stone, chiseled stone, uh, makes us the obelisk on its own, which produces neutral essence. So, if I have a look in here, we should have one, two, three, four of those. I think I have got a chiseled stone there. And more Vintium dust. I need some more out of the bag. I'm going to have to go and kill that dog in a minute. <laughs> She's driving me up the wall with this. She's the same every bloody year. And... It, it, it just just beyond a joke, really. Uh, so we've got the obelisk. You can fuel it with Vintium Dust or with Liquid Essence. Now, there is a lot of Liquid Essence over that way. But for the... Oh, the other thing we are going to need... <laughs> let's not forget the uh, all-important... Where are you? Not blocks, you're in items. And... You should be in items. Tools, tools. If I were a crystal wrench, where would I be? Let's have a look at the crystal the crystal wrench. So it needs a desert nova, two the iron and vintium dust. Fortunately, as I say, I've been out gathering, so I've got the desert nova. I have got well, what was it? 
doesn't know that I haven't got any blue orchids. Ooh, pants. That is going to make diff life difficult. I'm going to have to go out and get some blue orchids now. Where the hell did blue orchids grow? Uh, let's see whether the book tells me. Um. Yeah, uh, da -da. No, it doesn't. Which is a shame. Now, blue orchids, blue orchids. Where did we find blue orchids? Right, I'm going to have to go and find some blue orchids anyway, so I will be right back. Okay, that was a fun, entertaining period of time, shall we just say? It wasn't really, I'm, I'm lying. Um, took me ages to find these. They occur in cold biomes, basically, so uh, I've been strolling around all the snow-ridden uh, biomes, and there we go, one crystal wrench. Right, so that gives us, I think, everything we need to make this healing spell. Um, but first thing we need to do is pop this thing down. Let me just go... Uh, I'd like to have something ornamentally to stand that on, actually. So let's just go and get a little bit of that marble. There you go. Uh, I haven't got, oh god, I haven't got enough. Damn it. Um, I wonder if there's any down here. Let me just go and have a look. It doesn't actually matter, this is completely unimportant as in the grand scheme of things. No, I think there might be some up that way, but we'll just plop it down for now, it'll live. Okay, up we go. If you're getting dizzy, so am I. <laughs> Right, so we'll stick you, we'll, we'll stick it here, why not? And what I'm going to do is, I while I was out, I grabbed a... In fact, I'm going to... I need two of those, don't I? One, two. I'm going to stick some Vintium in there. Now, at the moment, we can't see how much essence there is in there, but we can link it in, and I know that that Vintium will, will link... <clears throat> this thing correctly so we should have plenty of juice I'll have to get uh, the other one I need to get is a Meiji Tex uh, staff at some point wherever you've gone Meiji uh, in fact let's go and do that now because that's dead easy I can do that um yeah, so these flowers, one of the main problems of Britannia is, right, I need a little bit of that, and a little bit of that, and a little bit of this, and shake you up, yeah, alright, enough about that, uh, five, is that enough? Yeah, perfect, absolutely perfect. So at least we can check what the mana levels are until we get some uh, decent infused armor and stuff. Okay, let's have a look. How are you doing? You have got 1,500, and I only need 500. I have a bucket of liquid ethereum as well, so that's pretty good. Okay. Healing spell. First aid, as I've decided to call it. Start off, as always, blank rune. It wants a... Orm. It wants a bit of Vintium Dust, it wants a Lesser Focus, and now it wants that, and then some more Vintium Dust, then an Arrow, a Snowball, a Green Rune, another Orm. It wants a blue rune, golden apple, and finally, spell parchment. And this is first aid. It's going to have to, it's going to be a little, we'll have it in blue. Little heart. So I can cast it on myself. It will give me, I should have given me regeneration. Why did you not give me regeneration? Hmm. 
anyway. Oop. <laughs> it costs a fair bit as well. Uh, but at least I can heal myself now when I head off to the nether. So the next thing I need to do is... Most likely I need to clear my inventory somewhat. Um, find a spot for the... Um, Stick those in there for now. I'm not going to be able to find anything anyway, so I don't see why I'm getting all antsy about where things go. I've got plants going there, that's about it. And that can go in there out of the way. So I am going to clear my inventory. I'm going to put my spells away that I cut, uh, that I have made, which is this shelf here. Uh, and I've got some obsidian somewhere, so there's nine there. There should be some more somewhere else. I basically went out and took out more or less an entire lava pool in the wild. <laughs> so, uh, that's an ugly critter. God only knows what he's found. Um, so yeah, I'm going to build a portal room and I will be right back with you. Okay, so one last thing I want to do before I go running off to this portal. I want me to turn the uh, light level indicator thing off. Um, I need to make a quick piston, well two quick pistons actually, but uh, I'll take a couple of those and the, see, it, the torch levers has this spike trap which if you combine it with a pressure plate it will uh, become an automatic spike trap so, if we quickly throw together a couple of pistons, not... Uh, actually, no, one will be enough. Uh, but, 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 uh, but, but, getting busy on here these days. Uh, bonk, bonk, and like that. So that will make, make us these two spike traps. Now, if I then go... I make a couple of pressure plates and also I could do with a lever oh there we go handy oh of course I could do with a flint and steel that would be useful for lighting up the old uh, portal just get that in there oh can I there we go Yeah, it's getting busy on here these days. Uh, <laughs> um, so what I've done is I've gone... What I've done is I completely forgot to build to the door. That was my... the thing I was going to do. Uh, give me, give me, give me... Give me some beach. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh. Ah! I'm picking everything up except what I want. And... And let's go and have a look at this portal. Now, there is a very good chance I will kick the bucket here. So before we go, I will just go and empty my inventory of everything that I don't want to lose. Um, but it occurred to me what we could do is if I go and get that there and that there. Now, if I... See? <laughs> Now, what I should be able to do, I think, if I can get, just sneak you in, oh no, I can't, ah no, right, let me just get some old uh, stone down there, and a bit of redstone, now I believe a redstone signal will turn this off, so, let me go and just give that a try. That's on. Now let's see. What... No, it doesn't. <laughs> okay. Right. That's not so good. Okay. Well, it was worth a try. Well, of course, it might not. The signal might not have trans trans um, tr transpired up, transcribed, trans transferred the. Trans something or other, transmogrified or something along those lines anyway. 
So we'll come up, well, I'll do some more research into those, but those are quite useful for um, stopping mobs coming out. Uh, but the door will do as a uh, as an interim thing. Right, I'm just going to prepare myself for this. As I say, there's a very, very good chance I will die. <laughs> so, uh, and at the moment, I am on zero deaths. So, that would be... This, these fire bats, are they still there? Where's he gone? I just saw him fluttering around like an idiot. Nope, he's gone. I didn't even know they could spawn in the overworld, so... Imagine my surprise when I see a fire bat flapping around outside my window. So yeah, I'm just going to uh, prepare and I will be right back. Okay, wish me luck. This could be uh, a really bad idea. Given what I've seen of... Uh... Oh crap. about the worst place they could have put it. Oh, man. And there is some badness. All I want... Ew, what's that? Nether essence ore? Hmm. Shiny, but what I want is that. More than anything in the world, I want that. Please, please, please don't be anything nasty around here. Belfs, I don't want any Belfs, don't want any. If you've not played Lycans, mobs, <laughs> 19, that will have to do. I don't think I'll need a lot. Uh. Can't mind that at the yeah. But I do want some of this nether rack. Just a bit. Uh, I'm going to grab that while I'm here. Because I don't know what it is. And what better reason to grab something. Anyway, we are alive. And we're gone. <laughs> Like I said, it was a quick in and out job. Um, but that's all I needed. I just needed a little bit of red uh, glowstone. Uh, right, so now we can get on with the essence refiner. So, let me have a look what we need for that. The essence refiner. Diamond. Obsidian. What did I need that for then? I needed that for something. Arcane ash. Arcane compound. Yes. Ah, uh, we now know why I went and grabbed that. So I need to make some arcane compound. That's the first thing. But we can get the essence to find it done. I need a diamond, some logs, uh, and let's get this on the underway I need five logs uh, one two three four five I need a diamond let me put that back back in my inventory I'll sort the rest um, and yeah let me just grab this a diamond please thank you and quickly answer that I'll get the stuff together and I will be with you in a mo Okay, and the firewalk madness has started outside. I've got the arcane ash, so we should be good to make the essence really finer. We're also going to be good to make the light spell now. Um, <clears throat> now, the essence refiner I need to make, it was earth essence. I know I can look these up in the book, but earth essence. No, find the right one, this one, and that is dirt, two stone, 
that and an arcane ash. <clears throat> Makes me an earth essence. Uh, I'm probably going to need a fair bit of that though, because if I remember rightly, I think I need a three. So what I'm going to do is I will get everything necessary together to use this next time. Um, and we will get the light spell done, because the light spell is pretty critical to uh, what we want to do. Now I'm thinking Essence Refiner can go there. Um, so for the light spell, let me just put you out of the way. I needed... I think I can do pretty much everything. I need a Vintium Torch. Uh, let's go and pull that. In fact, what I will do, I think, is I'll pull everything together that's pretty standard fare, and uh, I'll come back just to let you know, so show you the, the odd other bits and pieces, and then we'll get that crafted, and we can finally say goodbye to these horrible things, and, uh, and actually get some magical light on the situation. Um, so yeah, I will see you again in a couple of minutes. Okay, we've got everything together. The only thing that's a little... well, not quite everything together. The only thing that's a little bit odd is the Vintium Torch, which is just to stick with Vintium Dust. Nothing overly fancy there. Oh, God, I really do need to sort my inventory out big time. Uh, but I do need a Spell Parchment. That's the last thing we're missing. So we will get that done. And... Our path to uh, magical mastery is one step closer. As I say, we will uh, we will next time get the get the improved dig spell done. But this should be everything we need. So, blank rune, vintium dust, a feather. For some reason, a fish, clay, vintium dust. Arrow, snowball, white rune, just bone meal and a blank rune, uh, a blue orchid, glowstone dust, vintium torch, and a spell, which we will use. Ooh, what, what icon do we use for that? A little torch spell. That. That will do. So that re will replace those. And uh, if I go into here, this is a touch version, so we can just happily go around and obviously make sure we've got F7 on so we can make sure everything is illuminated. But this means we can get rid of these ugly, vile torches. Um, and once we've got the dig spell finalised, we can get rid of that pickaxe once and for all as well, which will be perfect. So yeah, we can do the same over here, and probably there. I have got the projectile version as well, so I've got a little bit more range on it, but that's going to be... This just means for me that we don't have any unpleasant torches hanging around the place. So yeah, my work's cut out. Go around and replace all the torches and uh, and incidentally gain some levels while we're at it. Uh, the other thing we can make before we finish, just to, uh, to tidy up, because uh, that heal spell is not one that we would have on the uh, on the hot bar all the time is our spell book. Uh, don't need the ar I would like the arcane spell book, but I'm going to have to wait for that leather to and string. I think we can manage all of that. Uh, leather, string, and where did I put that pap paper? There. So we should be able to go. Actually, we should be able to shift click that in. Yeah, bang, spell book. And now we can add our heal spell to the bar and we're sorted. 
So yeah, we're making progress. We uh, we survived the Nether against against all odds, and uh, the dig spell is the next thing. Now, once we've done this dig spell, my my next mission in life, I think, will be to start to tackle a little bit of Batania. Um, <laughs> I think someone just noticed, yeah. <laughs> someone just noticed that the squid dropped calamari there. Um, yeah, so... They're not Batania. Oh, what am I talking about? Not but well, I do want to do Batania, but the one I want to play with is this. Essence Dust. Because um, you can use this to make weak essence, and then you can use those to make regular and strong and extreme um, and if I go well, let me just come back out of there and go use uh, for that and you can see there if you combine those with four coal and some essence seeds which you make by just surrounding some seeds with essence you get coal seeds for example now the one that I am specifically interested in uh, dye seeds, water seed, yeah wonderful, fire seeds, no, earth seeds, no, air seeds, no, these give uh, essence that you can get your infused ingots and stuff like that, but if we go, let me just get back here and say the use for the standard one, get glowstone seeds, and more, you know, not redstone seeds, but more importantly, you can get glowstone seeds. And those are going to be invaluable because the thoughts are going to the nether every time and we can, can get all of the metals basically. Vintium seeds would be useful so we could get some Vintium dust and make some of those, get those things going. Um, and obviously you can use those to, to go and make iron seeds, gold, blaze rod seeds, ender seeds. And the list goes on experience seeds, nether seeds, cow seeds, creeper seeds, so you can grow creepers should you want to, magma seeds, skeleton seeds, slimy seeds, all sorts of seeds, potion seeds, so you've got night vision seeds, which you can do. Um, no idea what half of this stuff is, aluminium, more copper, chimerite, useful shards you can get through seeds there um, and if you I think if you go to the the next level up for the extreme essence diamond seeds emerald seeds wither skeleton seeds obsidian defender I have no idea what that is a health orb there's so much essence infused leggings mark 3 so there's a whole buttload of Unbreakable Lightbringer, plus 9 damage, no idea. Um, yeah, but there's a whole buttload of stuff we can do with this Essence, Essence Bow, Unbreakable. Cobalt Seeds, very nice. Moonstone Seeds, Sunstone Seeds. I'm guessing Ardite Seeds somewhere in there. So, yeah, oh, and Infused Coal. <laughs> so... That is definitely something I want to look at next time. But for now, that will be it from me. Um, I will be doing some infusing. And that is just simply a matter of sticking essence in that thing and powering the infuser just to get the stuff we need for the next spell. Um, so until next time, thanks for watching, guys. And I will see you soon. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.